Today on Mr. Music Man TV, five little monkeys are back on the bed. Mr. Andrew plays a game about tempos. And what's the word of the day? Miss Shay has the answer. Coming up first. little monkeys, let's get ready for our lesson today. Five little monkeys jumping on a bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. All right, big box kid, let's go to four. Four little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. All right, Mr. Music, it's your turn again. Three little monkeys, let's go. Three little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, no more monkeys jumping on the bed. All right, big boy kid, I think I'm dreaming. Oh, little monkeys, stop jumping on the bed before you fall down and bump your legs. Oh, 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 oh. Right, right, right back to the song. Two little monkeys jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. I miss it, you up. One little monkey. Here we go. One little monkey jumping on the bed. One fell off and bumped his head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. All right, everybody, let's sing it. No little monkey jumping on the bed. None fell off and bumped their head. Called the doctor and the doctor said, No more monkeys jumping on the bed. All right, I'm just yeah, dreaming. Yeah. a tempo for you to sing and play at home. If I say Andante, you gotta play and sing nice and slow. If I say Moderato, you gotta play a little bit faster. And if I say Allegro, you gotta play really fast. Are you ready? Let's play. Round, Round one. On <laughs> Dante. Moderato. Excellent, friends. Moderato is a little bit faster, but not too fast. Round three. Allegro! That's right, a red goes nice and fast. Now let's add one more. If I say accelerando, you gotta start slow and get faster and 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 faster. All right, let's play again. Round one. 
Moderato. Nicely done. Round two. <laughs> Allegro! That's right, Allegro is fast! Round three! <laughs> On Dante! Accelerando! Slow, faster, 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 That's Accelerando! You win! Great game. You played our tempos amazingly. Nicely done, nicely done, nicely done, nicely done, nicely done. Mr. Music Man, word of the day. It's time for our word of the day. Can I get a drum roll, please? Our word of the day is... Mira. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Around the World with Shay. On today's episode, we are learning about a new special instrument. But first, we need to look at our map so we can see where this instrument comes from. Do you remember our seven continents? Good, let's say them together. North America, South America, Europe, Africa, Asia, Australia, Antarctica. Now, which continent does our instrument come from today? If you guess Africa, yes, you guess right. Our instrument comes from Africa. There is a country on the southern tip of Africa called Zimbabwe. So our instrument today comes from the country of Zimbabwe, which is on the continent of Africa. There are so many animals that live in Zimbabwe, like the lion. Yes, the lion. What do you think lions like to eat? Plants or meat? They like to eat meat. Yes, because lions are carnivores. Lions usually live in pride, which consists of a few females and a very small number of males. The male lions, the boys, usually stay and protect the land that they live on and the rest of the pride. The female lions, the girls, usually go out and hunt for their food. is the African elephant. This is the largest land animal. Elephants can get really, really, really big. What do you think elephants like to eat? Meat or plants? Love to eat plants. 
plants. They are herbivores. Another animal that lives in Zimbabwe has lots and lots of spots on it. It is the leopard. Can you say leopard? Very nice. Leopards are solitary animals, which means they don't like to be around other animals. They like to stay by themselves. Another animal that lives in Zimbabwe is really, really tall. But there's a reason why they're so tall. Yeah, it's because they need to reach the very, very top of trees. This animal is the giraffe. Can you say giraffe? Very good. Hmm. Giraffes like to eat leaves on trees. So are they carnivores or herbivores? This is our instrument. This is called the kalimba. Can you say kalimba? The kalimba is made out of wood. It also has pieces of metal here that we call keys. So the kalimba is made out of wood and metal. The kalimba comes from this instrument. This instrument is the embera. Can you say embera? Although the kalimba and embera are often considered to be the same instrument, they are actually different. Can you spot the differences? The keys on the embera have two layers and are not labeled with notes. The keys on the kalimba are not layered and can be labeled with notes. The embera is also the national instrument of Zimbabwe. The embera is traditionally played by a group of people called the Shona. The Shona have played the embera for thousands and thousands of years. The Shona play the embera for religious ceremonies and social gatherings and parties. They place the embera inside of a large gourd to amplify the sound. That means to make it louder. Because the embera is played with your thumbs, it can also be called the thumb piano. Can you say idiophone? Very good. An idiophone is an instrument that makes sound primarily by the vibration of the instrument itself. So there are no strings on idiophones. There is no mouthpiece on idiophones. And there are no membranes on idiophones. Here are some examples of idiophones. The cymbal, bells, the xylophone. Another example of an idiophone is a triangle. The embera and the kalimba are not only idiophones, but they are also a part of the percussion family. Thank you for watching Around the World with Shay. Bye, friends. Hey, Mom and Dad. Be sure to help your children say and use our word of the day this week. And if you and your kids are enjoying our classes, smash our subscribe button and follow us on Facebook and Instagram to be the first to receive our latest class every week. And if your child wants more Mr. Music Man, you can go to mrmusicmancompany.com forward slash TV where you can find classes from all of our Mr. Music Man locations all together in one place.